people often get confused with the terms ethical hacking and cybersecurity. Well, cybersecurity is a broad term in which various computer security mechanisms are included, and ethical hacking is one of them. Hello, everyone. I welcome you all to today's session by Edureka, where we will understand the difference between ethical hacking and cybersecurity. But before we get started, if you like our videos, please subscribe to the Edureka YouTube channel and hit the bell icon to never miss an update. Also, if you're interested in an online certification course, we have a course on cybersecurity in collaboration with EC Council, which you can check for a certification course. So first, let us understand what we mean by ethical hacking and what is cybersecurity in detail, and then we will discuss the difference between the two. After which, we will talk about which one is better, ethical hacking or cybersecurity. So according to today's agenda, let's start with what is ethical hacking. So ethical hacking is a process of detecting vulnerabilities in an application system or organization's infrastructure that an attacker can use to exploit any organization. They use this process to prevent cyber attacks and security breaches by lawfully hacking into the systems and looking for weak points. So an attacker or an ethical hacker follows the same five-step hacking process to breach the network or system. The ethical hacking process begins with looking for various ways to hack into the system, then exploiting vulnerabilities, maintaining steady access to the system, and lastly, clearing one's track. So the first step in the ethical hacking methodology is reconnaissance, which is also known as footprint or information gathering phase, which is the initial phase of hacking. So this is the planning phase. The second step in the hacking methodology is scanning, where the attackers try to find different ways to gain the target's information. This step of ethical hacking involves finding easy and quick ways to access the network and skim for information. The next stage of hacking is when an attacker employs all available tools to gain unauthorized access to the target's networks, systems, or applications. After gaining access to the target system, the attacker makes every effort to keep it that way which is the maintaining access part. And lastly, since no hacker wants to get caught, the final stage of ethical hacking requires hackers to cover their tracks. This phase makes sure that the attackers don't leave any traces or signs that could be used to identify them. Up next, we'll learn about what is cybersecurity. Cybersecurity is the practice to defend internet-connected systems such as hardware, software, programs, and data from damage. It helps prevent cyber criminals from gaining access to data systems or networks. The global cyber threat continues to evolve at a rapid pace with a rising number of data breaches every year. A report by Risk-Based Security revealed that a shocking 7.9 billion records have been exposed by data breaches in the first nine months of 2019 alone. This figure is more than double, that is 112% more the number of records exposed in the same period in 2018. So with the scale of the cyber threat set to continue to rise, the International Data Corporation predicts that worldwide spending on cybersecurity solutions will reach a massive $133 billion by 2022. This is why governments across the globe are responding to the cyber threats with guidance to help organizations implement these effective cybersecurity practices. Now, after understanding the meaning of ethical hacking and cybersecurity, let's discuss what are the difference between the two. So the first point of comparison is function. That is what each of them do. So ethical hacking helps us find different vulnerabilities in the system and helps to report against it, while cybersecurity helps protect the data and the system from malicious activities. So coming to the mode of action, the focus of ethical hacking is on how to attack the system, while the focus of cybersecurity is how to protect the system. That is, ethical hacking is on the offensive side, where cybersecurity is on the defensive side. Now, coming to the spectrum, ethical hacking is a subpart of cybersecurity, while cybersecurity is a broad domain that includes a range of security techniques, which includes ethical hacking. Now, coming to the purpose, the purpose of ethical hacking is to perform different penetration testing to find the vulnerabilities or exploit them. While the purpose of cybersecurity is to detect problems and guard the system against these security breaches. Now coming to the production environment, ethical hacking requires to evaluate 
the systems of the organizations according to the security policies that are pre-existing in the organization. While cybersecurity involves auditing all the security technologies that are already being used in these businesses and look for infringement. Next comes update. So here we are talking about how ethical hacking requires the system to regularly get tested in order to find any bug and fix any weaknesses that may already exist. While in cybersecurity, it has a routine checkup that is a maintenance to keep the security system up to date every day. After this, we're talking about reporting. So in ethical hacking, it is very important to make reports and documentation of the entire process of hacking. Like starting from the very initial phase to the final phase, it is very important to understand the entire process of hacking. While in cybersecurity, more than documentation, it is more important to have accountability for creating a system's access rights. Now talking about ease of learning, ethical hacking requires intensive creating thinking to crack into different systems of organization. While in cybersecurity, you can learn different technologies and tools in order to get started. So in ethical hacking, the popular job roles include penetration tester and security manager, while in cybersecurity, the job roles include security analyst or SOC engineer. Now coming to the average salary, in India, the average salary of any ethical hacker is around 5 lakhs per annum, while in the US, it is around 1 lakh dollar per year. So talking about the average salary, in India, the average salary of an ethical hacker is around 5 lakhs per annum, while in the US, it is 1 lakh dollar per year. Whereas in cybersecurity in India, the average salary is around 6 lakhs per annum and in US, it is $117,000 per year. So now let us understand which one is better. So depending on how an organization approaches the challenge, cybersecurity and ethical hacking play critical roles in system security. Data and computer assets for a specific company's networks are safeguarded by cybersecurity while anything that goes into assaulting these components with authorization is considered as ethical hacking. So the cybersecurity expert's role is to safeguard informatics against any danger before, during, or after any violation has occurred. While ethical hackers go by many titles, including White Hat, which is considered the best security professional with experience in discovering and leveraging flaws and faults in networks, much like any illegal hacker would do. So these hackers utilize the same tactics but with authorization and legally before malevolent intruders can get access. The cybersecurity and ethical hacking sectors are more important than ever because of many online threats and assaults. The need for cybersecurity experts and ethical hackers is continuously expanding. It depends upon your interest, skills and relevant educational background to answer cybersecurity versus ethical hacking which one is better. So choose your career option keeping these factors in mind. So if you like this video, please press the like icon and subscribe to our Edureka YouTube channel for more content. See you again on our next video. Until then, happy learning. I hope you have enjoyed listening to this video. Please be kind enough to like it and you can comment any of your doubts and queries and we will reply them at the earliest. Do look out for more videos in our playlist and subscribe to Edureka channel to learn more. Happy learning!